guys and welcome to my channel. Today it's what's for dinner day and I am sharing five different dinner recipes. I hope you enjoy them and until next time hope you guys have a wonderful day. For dinner tonight we are having pork chops on a barbecue and um, I have taken out two extra ones for lunch tomorrow and I seasoned them with Le Grill Clubhouse Seasoning Montreal Steak Spice this is, uh, we like this seasoning a lot, especially for pork and for steak. I took out, I'm um, going to do two baked potatoes for my kids. And then I have cut up some broccoli, cauliflower, yellow, and green zucchini, seasoned it with salt and pepper, and some avocado oil. And that's going to go in the oven. And then we're going to have a Greek salad with it that I have left over from yesterday. Today for dinner, we are having a chicken bake. Um, baked chicken in the oven, I guess. And um, here are my chicken breasts. And I will season them with basil, oregano, garlic, pepper, some parsley, red pepper flakes. And then I will pin fry it just uh, to brown it on each side with some um, avocado oil in my pan. And then while that's browning, I'm going to cut up my veggies. And I'm just using stuff I have on hand. I'm going to add red onion to this. So zucchini, peppers, red onion, and tomatoes. And then I'm going to cook those once the chicken's done. I'm going to cook those a little bit just to soften them up. I'm going to mix it all in my baking pan and sprinkle it with cheese. I'm using Parmesan and mozzarella and bake the rest of the time in the oven. So here is the chicken cooking and now I'm going to cut up my veggies. So I cut up the veggies that I'm going to cook after the chicken is done. I will be adding tomatoes into the baking dish. I'm not going to pre-cook them before. So I added the bacon, I added some broccoli too, we'll see how that ends up tasting. And I am just cooking up some veggies here that I'm going to be adding in here. So here it is, I have added tomatoes and the veggies and then tomatoes on top. And then I have added a parsley, basil and oregano. So it's all done and I'm added both parmesan and mozzarella. I'm going to put it in the oven at 400 for about half an hour to 40 minutes until the chicken is done. I will be covering it with tin foil. So here's the chicken with veggies and I just put it with some Caesar salad. For, for dinner tonight we are having Cajun chicken thighs and I also have some chicken breast that I will be barbecuing for, well my husband will be barbecuing for the next uh, couple days to have it with salad uh, Greek salad and then I already made it I just like to marinate the flavors and there's black olives feta tomatoes um, cucumber red onion and romaine lettuce and then I cut up some veggies and season them up with Himalayan salt and some black pepper and olive oil and that will go on a grill for dinner tonight we are having buffalo chicken wraps and I am just cutting up my chicken I got more to cut up and I will be adding some red hot buffalo sauce my kids have developed a real taste for this stuff so I thought I make them a special recipe and I and the chicken needs to sit in the buffalo sauce for half an hour before I bake it Dinner time is buffalo chicken wraps. Although I don't think I'm going to be able to wrap my lettuce around that chicken. For dinner tonight, we're having garlic butter shrimp. Um, the kids are going to have rice with it. I just haven't decided whether I'm going to make a risotto or just plain rice. We're having just some roasted cauliflower and I'm going to make a Greek salad to go with it. Here it is. I decided to have a little bit of rice. I had an extra yellow container left. For dinner tonight, we are having tacos, beef tacos. So here's my meat. 
I cut up some onion and garlic, made some taco seasoning, cut up some tomatoes, and I will be adding tomato paste as well, and some red pepper. I will also be making some guac, and for that you, I am just making a small batch, so I'm going to do two avocados, half a lime, half a jalapeno pepper. If it was just me, I would probably put the whole thing, but I have kids that don't like it as spicy. quarter of an onion, and some tomatoes, and some cilantro. So I'm going to have my husband cook the meat, and I will be making the guac. So here is the meat already and all the trimmings. We got cheese, different sauces, uh, there's homemade salsa, the guac, some of the tomatillo, the salsa verde, sour cream, and I'm just going to cut up some jalapenos for myself. I am having it in a salad. The kids are having it with the crunchy shells. And here is my salad. I just um, crunched up some one hard shell.